Hello everyone, I am Dr. Abba Kumari. Today we will discuss some problem from tracing of curve. Earlier we have discussed the problem in Cartesian form. And today we will see how can we trace the curve for polar form. So to find the tracing of curve, we have taken here the curve of cardioid. R equals to A1 plus cos theta. So let us see the what are the steps. So in the five steps we can solve this problem. In the first step we put minus theta for theta. Okay. And in the given equation of the curve. By putting the minus theta what we see here there is no change in the given equation of the curve. Therefore the given curve is symmetrical about the initial line. Now second one. Secondly. We replace the theta by pi minus theta. Then the given equation of the curve changed. Why? Because there is a cos theta and we have a pi minus theta. So therefore, the curve is not symmetrical about the line theta equals to pi by 2. And the third point, we put r equals to 0. While putting the r equals to 0 in the left hand side of the given equation of the curve, we see that theta is equals to pi. Why? Because 1 plus cos theta equals to 0 and this implies cos theta equals to minus 1 and this implies theta equals to pi. Hence the curve passes through the origin and the equation of the tangent at the pole is theta equals to pi and therefore we can say that the curve is uh, the tang equation of the tangent is the initial line. Let us come to the fourth step. In the fourth step, we, what we do is first we find the sum point so that we can trace the curve. So to trace the curve, we need some more points. To find these points, let us put theta equals to 0. So while putting theta equals to 0, we get r equals to a into 1 plus cos theta. And by putting theta equals to 0, we are having with the value 2a. That means whenever we have a theta equals to 0, we have r equals to 2a that means in the x-axis we will put the value of the curve which is only at the point x equals to 2a now when theta equals to pi by 3 then r equals to 3 by 2a when theta equals to pi by 2 what we see here is that when theta equals to pi by 2 we get the r equals to a that means when there is a pi by 2 so that in the y axis we will reach to the point only up to a now when theta equals to pi we have the value r equals to 0 similarly fifth point is what we see here is that how can we move in the upper direction in the lower direction also in the left and right hand side so to see that where is the curve will be traced we can differentiate the given equation with respect to theta so here we get dr by d theta equals to minus a sine theta so what we see here is that when the theta increases from 0 to pi here we have seen from 0 to pi then the value of the r decreases from 2 a to 0 here is 2 a to 0 so it is seen in the fourth one also the curve is symmetrical about the initial line. We have earlier it is seen in the first line that the curve is symmetrical about the initial line. Therefore, when theta increases from pi to 2 pi, now next we move to the pi to 2 pi. So what we see is that the r increases from 0 to 2 a. That means first we first the points are decreases from 2a to 0 and then when we move pi to 2 pi then the value of r increases from 0 to 2a that means in the lower part and the upper part both the value will be in up to the distance 2 now we draw the curve from the given equations whatever we have so here is our x-axis and then we have a y-axis so this is your x x dash y y dash fine since the curve is symmetrical about the initial line and what about the line i x equals to 2 a and here is your our a and the curve 
touches the origin that is passes through the origin so we have included this point 0 and 0 and also we have seen that when in the y axis we have the value when theta equals to pi by 2 then we reaches to only a so here the curve crosses the a and again reaches to 2a and then again come to a and then again is to a so this one is our equation give it the curve here is your pi by 2 right and there is your y axis so this is the required equation of the curve for the cardioid r equals to a 1 plus cos theta Okay, thank you.